So we're here, Truckee, California, at the High Fives headquarters, also known as the C.R. Johnson Healing Center, a place that provides healing to anybody at no cost. My name is Roy Tuscany. I am the CEO and founder of the High Fives Foundation. High Fives focuses on preventing life-changing injuries and providing resources and hope if they happen in the outdoors. It's a catalyst from my own life-changing injury. In 06, I sustained a life-changing injury when I went 130 feet on a 100-foot ski jump. Came down from 30 feet in the air and the resultant impact fractured my T12 vertebrae. And luckily for me, I was surrounded by good people that supported me, my recovery, and from that I said, hey, I gotta, I gotta pay this forward. Let's create a foundation that did what all these people did that were in my community for those that might not have community and then recreate it for them. And that's, uh, that's high fives. When we started High Fives, the facility was 680 square feet. Now, as we continually expand, we're closing in on 10,000 square feet. And this facility, it's where High Fives, the foundation headquarters itself operates, but also we have a gym, a gym that provides no question, no cost to anybody that we support to work one-on-one -on -one with a personal trainer. And then on top of that, we have mental health, physical therapy, acupuncture, and massage also under one roof. So an individual can get all the different modalities of healing at one stop. This past winter, we had record snow. Biggest winter ever on record here. And one day, 15 feet of snow came off the roof. And this entire wall came crashing in. I knew there was one guy in this world that I could call to solve the problem, to resurface this place, to provide that source of inspiration, that, that source of art, to give people the story that they wanna tell when they see it. I met Roy from Team Lewis. We were in London for an event there. Team Lewis came out and both did some volunteer work with both Flint Public Art Project and High Five. The mission goal is to use art as a tool to help inspire people to imagine change and revitalization in the city. When you put murals on these old dilapidated abandoned buildings, it just changes the look and it also changes the attitude of the people that are living in that area. My name is uh, Johnny Fletcher and I am an aerosol muralist. It starts with like, I guess, a photo of the area. Step two would be a mock-up design. Step three would be getting your paint order ready and getting that going. Step four would be prepping, masking everything off, preparing the space for paint. The last step would just be executing the mural. One of the ideas when Johnny and I were talking about creating the space is the window and playing off the, the nature with the window so when the window's open and you can see out it kind of blends in with the mural because it's got that similar background to it. The robot is a character I've used uh, over the last year or so and uh, Roy from High Fives enjoys this character so I wanted to incorporate it in a scene of nature that is something you would see in Truckee. Oh my God, Johnny. Dude, it's so good. Oh, it's so sick. It's like, go find your adventure and stay a kid your whole life, regardless of what outfit you decide to wear. It's no. so cool. Healing doesn't just happen physically. Healing happens mentally, emotionally, socially. So when you can create a space that when you get into it, enriches your energy, enriches your senses. When that happens, like people get not just inspired, but they get like motivated beyond their skill level. And so for us to now have a story on one of our walls, a wall that earlier this year almost collapsed, it now has a story 
that inspires individuals to be whoever they want and to get back outdoors again and take on any challenge. <laughs>